that was written for this album is a song that had been running around the studio, and it was called Country Rocker, which I believe is going to be called Dear God. Dear God is uh, the biggest departure. It's something that we definitely wanted to have on the record. We've been listening to just a vast variety of music, and country being one of the biggest ones, so we went in that route. The original riff was written by Brian. The doo -doo 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 I had a riff, and it was very country-esque, and so we were like, well, let's just, let's just try that out. And then I was drunk on vodka in Big Bear when we decided to go right up in Big Bear, and we were thinking about the song and laying down melodies, and I picked up a guitar, and it just kind of flowed, the melody and the verse, and I wrote the chorus right there on the spot. I wanted to fill up the speakers sonically, but not without using electric guitars and making it, like, just kind of dense sounding. We had some great musicians on that track. We brought Shauna Crookson from Music Mafia. We brought them in, her in to sing on that song because we thought it would be a cool little country flavor to have her on it. In the beginning and then you kind of break off on those things. Sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. And that was definitely a treat because she's got a beautiful voice and that was just fun to hear her sing. So we did a lot of textures with banjo and acoustic guitars and just different flavors to make that chorus big. We brought in, you know, pedal steel. He was just a phenomenal player, so we kind of trade eights or sixteenths or whatever it is at the end. He just blows me away because he's just so much tastier and so much more melodic than I could ever be. I'm sitting there trying to think of the best shit I can play, and this guy's just, you know, in La La Land going crazy. It's just absolutely phenomenal. He's using every yeah. or, every appendage of his body to make that thing work. And he's doing a volume swell. Yeah. And he's kicking in the distortion. It's crazy. Sin plays it fucking flawlessly with such great feel. That's one of the things that I'll always be envious about. He plays with so much feel that he could play any style of music. You know, you can actually hear just everything that we're feeling coming across the way that he plays the notes and stuff. And I think that's really cool. And we kind of wanted to fade out like Hotel California style where it just kind of goes different solos, different textures, and you kind of just listen and get in the groove and just have it flow like that. But this song was just made when you're driving down the highway, you know, it's a long journey just to put your mind at ease, sort of. A, a road song, it's about being away from people that you miss and love and wanting to get back home to them and just being alone and lonely. I know a lot of people feel that way a lot of the time when on the road. Just kind of the whole journey of writing the album, it's kind of, you know, a finishing point just to kind of relaxing into the madness that's going to be the album. We've always had our, our slower, more ballad songs, like Seize the Day or I, I Won't See You Tonight. And I think we really captured a lot of cool things and tried a lot of new things with that song. And I think you're probably going to hate it. So fuck you. Just kidding. I tell you, I love all these guys, man. I tell you, they're great. The Jimmys. He gets a couple of drinks in him, he touches me, you know, places. I mean, come on, man. He's a wild guy. And the Johnny shit, man. The guy fucking farts worse than my fucking... It's like sulfur. <laughs> shit. It's sulfur. <laughs> you want to tell us a little about what you did on the record exactly besides write, produce, conduct? I mean, what else did you do? I, I heard there was a lot of vocal comping going on here. and Well, I comped your vocals, you know, Shadows. You did a great job. Like I said, the I, I, I is very great, very cool, you know. I love that shit. And uh, I'll tell you something right now. This is... Just between, you know, me, you, and, you know, the kids that are at the home, the the Gates, man, he did not play a couple solos, if you know what I mean. I just, you know, I, late one night, I, I play guitar. Oh, you, know? you play guitar, too, huh? That was yeah. you. Well, I wanted to thank you personally for uh, making a record better than it, better than it would have been. <laughs>